and welcome back. <sighs> welcome back. What are you doing? Selling with my Paul Gerhardt. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Thank you. I sing that all the time, man. <laughs> Somebody comes back. Welcome. Good stuff. Welcome. And the teacher is like a professional poker player. You make it. Welcome back, Carter. Almost to best like TV theme songs. The small time. town of Rothan. Rothan. Which is really close to Samunia. Oh man. Damn, we've traveled good ways, guys. Um, when not our first road trip. <laughs> you encounter, you know, a couple of things, bandits and shit like that. I'm not even gonna make your roll combat for it because it would be senseless. Uh, <laughs> I roll <laughs> combat for the entire exchange. I roll natural sixteen. <laughs> yeah. You guys are just gonna. It's a good way to do it, actually. You guys are gonna wreck. Even with a one, we kind of wreck a bunch of you. Like, you find a group of orcs, you find a group of human bandits, you find a couple of... It's irrelevant, but you kill a bunch of stuff. And we murdered every last dang one of them. Yeah. Except one. And you make it to tell every, the, tell every the time to tell the one. Tale. You see... <laughs> to tell the tale. To spread the word of fate. We actually mark the Sven logo in his forehead. <laughs> like Brad Pitt and Glorious Bastards? Yeah. That's what we do. Works for me. You see the small town, or I say small town, the, the town of Rithon. In the distance while you're traveling down this road. And it gets to be evening time. You're almost kind of there when a thick foreboding mist... Oh, God, begins I hate to appear uh, almost from just like up out of the ground and obscure a lot of the vision that you had before, seeing seeing the town and everything. Think of man, fog of war sucks. <laughs> yeah, it is fog of war indeed. <laughs> and oh, that's right, I'm an idiot. You begin to see because like there were no trees in front of you when the fog was starting and as you're continuing through it there's you begin to see trees pockets of trees here and there uh, and, it, and it, it, it gets thicker and thicker that's what she said <laughs> and you start to hear and feel that's all it can take from the, the pushy smasher the pushy smasher Pussy smasher. <laughs> I am very ink. I'm the pussy smashers. <laughs> I figure that's actually how he sounds too. He's this big bear with this baby voice. <laughs> it starts to rain. Oh, I hate rain. And you see in the distance of this dark and gloomy mist. False identity papers. A light is a Peter It almost looks like. Uh, actually, give me some perception rolls, please. I rolled a uh, twenty-four. I got a nat one. <laughs> it's okay. I saw it. That's all right, and yeah, and Nagri gets it a appears four. to be this dice sucks. a campfire. So, I don't think it was a campfire earlier, guys. It's just me. I don't like it. I don't trust it. Not the campfire? It's just like a normal campfire. And you begin to hear some uh, some music, which I don't really have uh, to play or anything. But it 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 actually seems pretty cheery music for uh, a foreboding sort of place. There is that. <coughs> One moment, everybody! Actually, there's something. Uh, Nagri does. No, he does not. Does he not? No. What? He's an idiot. Once upon a time, 
There's a great philosopher. He doesn't have who had any one line, just one famous quote that stood above all the rest. And that quote from the infamous Admiral Akbar was it's a trap. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's 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 what I think. Oh, wait, he can detect magic, I will. Yes. So Nagri is going to detect try to detect magic. Okay. Um, Hopefully concentrating on this. Right. The thing is, the fog itself is magic. Okay. So with that all the glow, it's really difficult to see anything. Okay. Hey guys, the fog's mad. <clears throat> <by the way. laughs> you don't say. Yeah. Hmm. yeah. I can talk to dragons too, it's kind of cool. Huh, you don't say. <laughs> Yeah, I can I mean, talk to dragons. I haven't said that in a while, I don't you think. Know, you know, so. I can too, uh, right? You do know that. No, I can talk to him. Better. I can talk to bears. <laughs> it's debatable. Yeah. You, you kind of can't really talk to anybody very well. <laughs> well I can't can talk to bears. <laughs> Usually slurring your speech. <laughs> yeah. That's how dragons speak. That's what I was taught. <laughs> they have that. Who <laughs> touched you, Nagri? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> and as you get closer to it, because uh, it's just off off of the road a little bit, through the mist you start to see um, caravans and like uh, really really colorful covered wagons and oh yeah, looks good. You begin to smell festival. Sounds a bit like. Uh, Roast something, roast deer, roast yeah, mutton, vision. roast something that they've killed along the way. And roasted, yes. <laughs> oh, hello, kitty. Some tasty meats. Spellcasting, fifth level. And around the campfire, there's about 12, okay, uh, 12 people or so. Hmm. People. Yeah. <clears throat> they are human. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect timing. That's so good. Do do do. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work indeed. And somebody told me this was happy cheery music. Well this is just like the <laughs> the rainfall from the creepy woods. Uh like the back of that book says bound by fate, it's pretty dope. <laughs> the back of his book, the crystal straw. Oh. Fate. Yeah, this is bound by fate. No, on the back of the book, like the actual your your book book. Bound by fate. Yeah. Nice. That's funny. Cause you guys are fate. Yeah. <laughs> That's the deck. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, M sure says so smart. My the music. Chance. So like, as you're. Uh, Kind of approach the this 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 pathway. Um, the music doesn't stop, but they kind of wave you over. I'm nervous about this, guys. I don't like it. Uh, I think they're just partying. But fuck I don't it. Know. I like to party. <laughs> I smell roast meat. Let's do it. <laughs> you hear them telling stories, uh, guzzling wine. They are intoxicated. Do they look strange? Can I can, can I do a like quick humans? history check? Maybe I can. Uh, Possibly remember uh, stories or uh, legends sure. of uh, sure. this kind of happening. <clears throat> Nat oh, 20. Yeah. Natural 20. <laughs> okay. You have heard of this group of. Because you know of, of several different types of traveling bands mm -hmm. of uh, bards and circusy type groups. Um, this particular group of people is called the Vistani. V I S T A N I. Hmm. Uh, they are known. Gypsies. Huh? Gypsies. Yeah, they're kind of gypsies. I'm down with gypsies. I'll eat their. You see their here. children. The roasted <laughs> children. <laughs> the roasted children. <laughs> you don't eat children. Yeah, you all know that. 
Them sheets, whatever, as long as it's been roasted. Do you <laughs> Sometimes even raw. Okay. I'm so care. <laughs> I'm going to read this to you. I'm hungry. I like the gypsies. Uh, here we go. So, the Vistani are wanderers who live outside civilization, traveling about in horse-drawn, barrel-topped wagons, uh, called Vardos, not that that's not relevant, uh, which they build themselves, compared to Barovians, none of, none of whom you've met yet. Uh, they dress in bright colors, they uh, laugh a lot, drink heartily, they feel as much as they feel at home in Strahd's dreary land, they know they can leave it whenever they please, etc. They are, um, you know, smiths, haberdashers, cooks, weavers, all that kind of oh, stuff. Haberdashers? That could use me a fun hat. Because they make... They, they make all of their own stuff, basically. <clears throat> what to get happened, Guys, I'm telling you, this seems like a pretty good yeah. place to hang out. You know that their uh, their families and clans are very closely knit. Uh, they resolve disagreements through contests Ooh. that end in rec reconciliatory singing, dancing, and storytelling. I'm saying the wrecking of everybody's minds. Although... This sounds fun. Yeah. It sounds yeah. fun. Uh, I'm just trying to see how much of this I want you to know. That'll be fun. Yeah. So gypsies. Yeah, gypsies. we found some gypsies, guys. Magical fog gypsies. That weren't there earlier. Yeah. Teleportation so, holes. they kind of invite you over to the fire. It's a pretty sizable fire. And uh, would you like to sit down? We are just telling stories. Sure. I'll, Let me. I'll chill. Tell you a story. First. I'll fuck with you, Gypsy. Okay. We love new stories. So what I'm going to do <laughs> is play my fucking inch song. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna play it because I totally right. forgot it. Right. I'm gonna play <laughs> oh, play the Imps song, the and they haven't seen Imps actually. He's kind of hidden back. He's still in the fog. <laughs> yeah, and he's gonna come out and okay. Imps. Imps. <laughs> Imps. <laughs> I get scared. It's just Whenever a bear Imps, pops out. Um, bursts riding forth. his horse. A lot of them are, are like super surprised and like happy, and they they clap, and it's pretty cool. Right. <laughs> All right. It's very good showmanship. Thanks for cracking this Hmm. I have a crack in tooth in my inventory. Oh, yeah, we, well, we all do. We all got one. What is that? That's from killing it's it. I get that. What's it do? Yeah, nothing. It's a trophy. Sweet. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We figured that you would like a, a trophy from, from killing the Kraken. Deal. Moving on. Yeah. <laughs> that, is a good, that is a great story. We have one as well that we enjoy telling. And, and like everybody kind of sits down and, and it gets a little quiet whenever this 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 gentleman steps up. Nagri is also gone invisible <laughs> and has not come with us. <laughs> but he's like staying on the outside. Yeah, because okay. that's what Nagri would do. Avoiding Got any it. kind of conflict at Got all. It. <laughs> like, I'm just gonna not do that. A mighty wizard came to this There's land no over a year ago. I remember him like it was yesterday. He stood exactly where you're standing. A very charismatic man he was. He thought he could rally the people of Barovia against the Devil Strahd. Who none of you have heard of yet, until just now. Uh, he stirred them with thoughts of revolt and bore them the castle en masse. When the vampire appeared, the wizard's peasant army fled in terror. A few stood their ground and were never seen again. The wizard and the vampire cast spells at each other. Their battle flew from the courtyards of Ravenloft to a precipice overlooking the falls. I saw the battle with my own eyes. Thunder shook the mountainside and great rocks tumbled down upon the wizard. Yet by his magic he survived. Lightning from the heavens struck the wizard, and again he stood his ground. But when the, but when the devil Strahd 
fell upon him, the wizard's magic couldn't save him. I saw him thrown a thousand feet to his death. I climbed down to the river to search for the wizard's body, to see if, you know, he had anything of value. But the river Ivlis, I Ivlis, no, sorry, let's stop. But the river I Ivlis had already spirited him away. And then, like, they kind of clap and. Good story. Good yeah. well, that's good. You should go. You are new here, yes? Yes. You should go and speak with Madam Ava. Hmm. What sound of that? Shut. <clears throat> she hot? <laughs> <laughs> and who is this Madam Ava that you speak of? My fellow storytellers. She is a seer, and can read your fortune. But is she not? Mm, no. <laughs> <laughs> that was actually her, just now. <laughs> she's pooping. <laughs> Some say she's pooping. It's really uncomfortable for all of us. Uh, <laughs> that's great. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Oh man. Hang on, I gotta I'll pull up. We're really bad at this game. We're doing really well. <laughs> he was just make poop jokes all night. <laughs> well, <laughs> our characters like poop fight jokes. shit. That's all. <laughs> We're all really bad when we go to parts. <laughs> yeah. Something yeah, always fucking happens ever every leave a bar. This sounds like real life. And they kind of like <laughs> kinda. It's a pattern. Escort you in into that direction. Uh Madame Ava's tent is the largest tent. And is uh kind of near near this river. That's that that it turns out is pretty close by. It was hard to see in the fog. But as you get closer to Madame Ava's tent, the uh, <coughs> the the Ivlis River which is what he had mentioned earlier in mm. the story, is like right there, just flown along. Uh, oh, guys. So I'm I'm pretty familiar with uh, land and moving about and stuff, and there wasn't a river here earlier. I know. <laughs> yes, I looked. Was near. And, uh, and like, you still have a map, so you can, you can totally... There's, like, yes, no, river doesn't there's not supposed here. to be a river here, yeah. That, that story was sounded pretty, pretty scripted. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> pretty uh, pretty nose. Maybe spelly, but no, no, it was a good story. Heard stories just like it. These people though, they're kind of kind of weird. Because they eat children. <laughs> they don't eat children. They eat, they eat children. Um, I would like to. Gypsies eat children. Ask the madam about my sword. So you guys are going into the tent. Yeah. We're sending. We're okay. sending. I was gonna say on the outside. I'm going to go in and be like, hey, <laughs> outside the tent. As as, as you all enter sword. into the tent, uh, Nagri is entering invisibly. By the way, right. There are six, of course, chairs set out. Oh. And there are six of you, right? Uh, yeah, six. Yeah. Six of you. Nice yeah, for you. Elric. He did Elric not come behind to do research on the uh, Which? Magneto helmets for dealing with the uh, elephants. Yeah, for dealing with the elephants. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Anyway. Uh, what has Belena done this whole time? Please, oh, please. She's in just time oh, in time. somebody. <laughs> and have a seat. Probably, probably not agree. <laughs> and she kind of gets up. She is an older, she's kind of an older lady. Most definitely not agree. At least um, twice. The yeah, they're the best. Here. Best power couple of all of land. All of land. There's off everyone doing it. Wow. Uh, I need, <laughs> put this, sorry. Oh uh, man, we're about to. She looks at, and, Reload. okay. Corey. Reload. Position yourself in which you are 
Uh, seated. Use one of those dice to ask Madame Ava on the other side of the table. I'll be in the, the center. Or one of the sides. Is it a circle table or is it kind of like a it's, drafting? It's kind of a circle table. Okay, so we'll just all kind of sit around. Like that. What? Actually. Oh. Okay. Does that work? So she's like in the center? Where's yeah, the, I'll find a big that. donut table. Where's the just, position of power here? <laughs> just, just up high, and she can, she can easily. Yeah, she's yeah. a seer, so she knows right, right. She what's seems, going on. She's in kind of like a, uh, a rotating stool. Yeah. So that's I like that a lot, actually. Yeah, that's that's cool. She turns and faces. Uh, Evander, wait, where's Evander? Evander's there. Yeah. She turns and faces. Uh, Evander first. Evander Jadar. Nice. Bitch, I know my name. <laughs> I don't know you. <laughs> you had a uh, unfortunate run-in with Triad. Uh, yeah, I have. She's a seer. Oh. You know. She knows things. She knows things. Mm. Bye. She turns. Nagri. Uh, She's just, still invisible. <laughs> just Nagri. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Nagri. <laughs> you can speak with dragons. <laughs> <laughs> he actually takes his invisibility off and finally says, Thank you for understanding. <laughs> <laughs> she gets it. She gets it. Yeah. You are a pushy smash. <laughs> You're a bear. <laughs> you haven't lost many fights. You have lost one recently that has damaged your Burn. pride, perhaps. Nah, I'm, fine. <laughs> I'm okay with it. I don't mind. Yeah, you oh. do. Yeah. <laughs> Shake it. Mean, that's wrong. I don't know. I guess plus three. I'm sorry to hear of your parents. She is. Yeah, see the future. What happens? You're what? I will avenge parents. them. Or, yeah. She's a monk. They don't do revenge, do they? What do the monks do? How do, no. monk, how do monk? <laughs> what do monks do? <laughs> they punch things, and that's literally freaking it. I will, I will punch the person that did this. <laughs> <laughs> I will beat them up so bad. <laughs> Sai, Sai Nilo. Namer of weapons. <laughs> Collector of trophies. Trash. <laughs> She's like fucking burning us all. Yeah. <laughs> Tear us down. <laughs> like, you guys ain't nothing. You ain't shit. Woman. <laughs> Excuse me? Would you like your fortunes read? Sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. About me. Can you guess you can't read me. Just to let you know. <laughs> I'm still here too. Right. Hang on. I just wanna I just wanna hear her say something. I'm part of this party too, guys. <laughs> Eisensmith. <laughs> You're a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I'd probably So you have come to free Barovia Oh dude, I'm so fucked. Of its uh <laughs> of its curse. I'm so fucked. Yes? Uh I guess. I don't know. I was I was following these people. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Do we get to play a game? Cause no. Damn it! I want to play that it's game so a, bad. It's not a card game. Well, I was hoping it was the uh, tarot cards. No, I was hoping Sword. it was that. This come with the book? That no. Oh, that would have been sweet as well. Yeah. The deck of whatever it's deck called. Deck of anything? Yeah. No, no. <laughs> I'd be <laughs> down. certainly not giving you guys access to that. I'd be down for that right now. With Madam Ava. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. Let me get all of it situated here. Yeah, look at this little picture of Charleston. Oh, dude, that's that, uh. <coughs> that's a she railroad bridge. Yeah. That goes across to where the old fucking school was. Mm -hmm. What is it? Old picture of Charleston. I need it. Oh. Oh. Okay. Do I do, uh, I'm on like this thing, Albans, one in the sky. And I'll need you to 
to make Jeez, note of this, this because it's oh, very it's important. It, it, like, uh, it will actually dictate. And this See, this is the cool thing stack. about uh, the Curse of Strahd, yeah. is that the tarot reading will determine where the magical items are you need and where you'll find various uh, aspects of the quest, which I think is super neat. Because it because that means hypothetically it changes every time you play the, like play through it. Okay. So and it's all now yeah. it's all luck based. We could get lucky or not. Right. That right. Is. So <laughs> everything is here. Oh, we okay. are that would be awesome. In, in in this video here, and I'm going to shuffle the cards and we'll get I'll, set up. I'm going to go. Yes. 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 We will we will take a little break here and we'll be back later. I'm going to ask.